Thank you. Thank you for coming to Dragon Warrior Noodles and Tofu. <laughs> More tea? Lemon sauce? No. If you need anything, just ask. Thank you. Oh, the Dragon Warrior's mop. He mopped these very floors. Uh, 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 no touching. You get the mop dirty. He once waited on me. Awesome. Yeah, I have the stain to prove it. Hey, where's the Dragon Warrior? Oh, he doesn't work here anymore. He's busy out there protecting the valley. <gasps> the Dragon Warrior. Oh. Oh, yes. Yeah, all right, here. Okay. You should have told me you were coming. Hi, Dad. I would have saved you some stinky tofu. Uh, uh, Dad, can I talk to you? <laughs> of course, son. <laughs> In honor of my son, free tofu dessert for everybody. Oh. Uh, with purchases. Oh. oh, it's so good to see you, Paul. Have you lost weight? I can almost put my wings around you. Ah, uh, well, maybe a little. Oh, poor you. You must feel weak. Let me get you some soup. Ah, uh, no, that's okay, Dad. I'm not hungry. Not hungry? <laughs> Paul, are you all right? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm fine. I just... Earlier today, I was fighting these bandits. Uh-huh. Nothing too dangerous. I mean, they were just, you know... Yeah? And then the strangest thing happened. Uh, I had this crazy vision. I think I saw my mom and me as a baby. Uh -huh. Mom? A baby? Um, Dad. What are you talking about? How do I say this? Where did I come from? Well, you see, uh, son, uh, uh, baby geese come from a, a little egg. Uh, don't ask me where the egg comes from. Dad, that's not what I meant. I know it's not. Uh, I think it's time I told you something I should have told you a long time ago. Okay. You might have been kind of uh, 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 adopted. I knew it. You knew? Well, who told you? No one. I mean, come on, Dad. But if you knew, why didn't you ever say anything? Why didn't you say anything? How did I get here, Dad? Where did I come from? Actually, you came from this. It was just another day at the restaurant. Time to make the noodles. I went out to the back where my vegetables had just been delivered. There were cabbages, turnips, radishes. Only there were no radishes. Just a very hungry baby panda. There was no note. Of course, you could have eaten it. I waited for someone to come looking for you. But no one did. you inside. Fed you. Gave you a bath. And fed you again. And again. And tried to put some pants on you. <laughs> And then I made a decision that would change my life forever. To make my soup without radishes. And to raise you as my own son. <laughs> Xiaopo, my little panda. And from that moment on, both my soup and my life have been that much sweeter. And little Po, that's the end of the story. <laughs> look at me. <laughs> no, don't look at me. That's it? That can't be it. There's got to be more, Dad. Well, there was a time you ate all my bamboo furniture, 
<laughs> it was imported to... One dumpling, please. Dragon warrior size. <laughs> oh, Paul. Your story may not have such a happy beginning, but look how it turned out. You got me, you got Kung Fu, and you got noodles. I know, I just have so many questions. Like, how did I ever fit in this tiny basket? Why didn't I like pants? And who am I? <laughs>